Hello, welcome to Wisdom Yard Online TV, and this is Ayomiko, as always, taking you through the lifestyle show. Today, we want to talk about Momo. Yeah, you know, we want to talk about Momo today, not because we want to talk about it as adding it to your food or something, but we want to plead justice for Momo. <laughs> It was not around last week, I've been seeing it flying here and there. I was even thinking it's a joke. Maybe somebody's playing a prank somewhere that the one man professor Muhammad actually said that they want to ban Bomo because of economic growth. Really? Meanwhile, with that we are surprised. And we know the situation of Nigeria right now. If you go to the market and you want to buy any protein, you will still have like 1,000, 1,005, and they will not even cut it up to five pieces. But you see, Pomo, whenever you want to eat it, if you go to the market and you get correct Pomo Ijebu, you still buy it for 200 now, you can cut into 17 pieces. Cut me anywhere. Pomo comes true for us at every point in time. And now they not told us that is this same Pomo that they want to ban. You guys actually should have said it to us that you want to frustrate us till all of us till we just decide that okay, let us die, right? Because there are some certain condiments, there are some certain food that they can't live without Pomo. What do you want to tell me about preparing a four year without adding Pomo? <laughs> Or even you want to prepare a goosey and there is no pomo. Okay, let's forget about that one. Assorted. Does assorted do okay without pomo? A lot of sweat, sweat. I mean, peppered pomo. You know, you even go to some parties and they will just buy 10,000 era meat for the whole of the party. And you now see them bringing in pomo, adding it to substitutes. That is what for the economic growth. So why do you even think about that one? But you just came with has no nutritional value. Let me bust your bubbles. Pomo is very, very nutritious. If you're this kind of person that feels like you're adding too much weight of recent, substitute your general beef for pomo, and you'll see that your weight will come back to normal. So weight loss regulation, pomo is there for us. Apart from that fact, I will talk about strong bones and teeth. Pomo does so well. Calories. If you want to slow down on your calories, Pomo does very well. What else are you looking for? So, Pomo goes for everything. I can still remember when I was an undergraduate, there are some days that I don't even have money. I've already been sacralized. I'll just go to market, buy Pomo 200 naira. I'll cut it into like seven pieces. Hey, big girl like me. I'll buy a goosey, small a goosey, buy rodo 50, tomato 50, seven year. And I'm making my nice meal, eating my goosey, I let me 20,000 with 7 pieces of pomo, even 16 pieces of pomo. And I'm not telling that we should not let go pomo. Please, if you are also in support of this agitation, let's stand right. Let's stand strong for pomo. So I stand strong. Pomo no go minus. Pomo let me 20. No other thing can control us. No, not even Nigerian government. Thank you very much for joining me today. I stand right for Pomo. And until next time that we will fight another battle, I remain Ayomiku. Do well to like, share, and subscribe to every social media platform. Bye.